So how's it going guys? Uh, Nintendo has finally released its financial um, data earlier today or yesterday, depending on when you're asking, depending on when you're asking, depending on when you're watching this. So that this uh, covers the ending of fiscal year 2023, quarter three, not not the entire year or fiscal year. That, that goes uh, until the end of March. Then the April 1st will be the beginning of fiscal year 2024. So... This information is based on sales numbers coming from, or shipments, I should say, but I, I'll still say sales, though. Uh, ending December 31st of last year, so two months, not two full months ago, but two months ago, nonetheless. So, SKU numbers have been updated. Let's dive into them. More details can be found on Nintendo's website. I'll have the links down in the description if you guys want to find out more. So let's take a look at this. I got their website actually pulled up here right now. I got the wrong page open. So here you have, uh, let me see if it lets me zoom in. I guess it's not gonna let me zoom in. Uh, that's okay. Um, if the Nintendo Switch, we're not, yes, here's the other platforms to sell. We're gonna be paying more attention to the Switch. So you got hardware sitting at 139.36 million units. It's software uh a thousand two hundred point ten million or we're, i'm just gonna say 1.2 billion units uh for uh software so now we're gonna look at the games here are are all the little i cannot talk i'm too excited <laughs> so here's all the games uh you got the top 10 now the pokemon games um sword and shield as well as scarlet and violet they're going to be included sword and Sh violet those are going to be included into a single game but, uh, along with sword and shield uh i'm sorry i said sword and violet i believe i meant scar scarlet and violet anyway let's uh go on so we got best-selling game on the switch right now is mario kart 8 deluxe which sits at 60.58 million units uh next we have animal crossing new horizons for at 44.79 million units Super Smash Bros. Ultimate in third at 33.67 million, followed by The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, 31.61 million. Then Super Mario Odyssey, 67, excuse me, Super Mario Odyssey, 27.65 million. Pokemon Sword and Shield, 26.17 million, followed by Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, 24.36 million. Super Mario Party, 20.34 million. And then the last two games, we got The Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom, which sits at 20.28 million. And then finally, New Super Mario Brothers U Deluxe, 17.20 million units. Now this is, of course, as of December 31st, not as of February 2nd. Today's February 2nd, when I'm, or excuse me, February 6th. When I'm making the, recording this video February 6th, this is based on December 31st, so it's not based on today. It takes time to get that uh, information. But anyway, um, so I'm going to show this once again. So you got this, and I'm not going to talk about their other platforms, but they are here if you want to look at them. Uh, I'll have the link in the description down below to these sites. If you guys want, it's just Nintendo's website, but you got hardware and then software uh yeah so let me look at my notes real fast see if i'm missing anything i mean i know there's other things i could talk about but that's mainly what i wanted to say yeah i think i covered everything it looks like i covered everything anyway yeah so nintendo's doing pretty well almost 140 million units uh it's getting closer to catching up to the ps2 i don't know if it will outsell the ps2 i think it could i think i think it will uh, maybe within the next year or so. Uh, but we'll have to wait and see if it outsells the PS2 and the Nintendo DS. To be, to see if it becomes the best-selling video game console of all time. I, I don't know. We'll have to see. I think it, I think it will. I mean, I'm not 100% sure. I'm kind of... I'd say I'm, I don't know, 65. I'd say I'm 70% sure that it's gonna happen but hey if i'm wrong i'm wrong it is what it is we'll have to wait and see i'd say the next year to a year and a half but uh yeah well also want to see what nintendo is planning for the next gen console uh i know 
a majority of this year, of the fiscal year 2024, they're going to be mainly focusing on the Switch. Uh, that doesn't mean there won't be new hardware, it just means they're not saying there's new hardware, they're not saying there's not new hardware, but the Nintendo Switch is going to be their primary focus. Anyway, let me know what you guys think on this if you have more to say. I want to thank you for watching. I will see you guys in the next video.